Warriors season finally got underway on Tuesday night. And after a long and glitzy and perhaps over-the-top ring celebration and championship banner unveiling, they got down to business on the court against the Oklahoma City Thunder. The Warriors jumped out of the gate strong, and their offense looked very good in the first quarter. Not surprisingly, Steph Curry was leading the charge. He picked up where he left off in the preseason by making his first five three-pointers of the night. Steph cooled down from beyond the arc after that, but he still had a beautiful all-around game and was highly efficient. He led the team with 32 points to go along with 8 rebounds and 9 assists, and he shot 11 of 20 from the field. Not surprisingly, Kevin Durant was right beside Steph when it came to offensive output. KD had 27 points, along with 8 rebounds and 6 assists, and shot 9 of 21 from the field. But after Curry and KD, the stars fell off a little bit. Klay Thompson, despite having a preseason in which he seemingly could not miss, struggled all night with his jump shot. Clay was just 1 for 8 from beyond the arc, and 5 for 20 from the field. He was visibly frustrated and upset for much of the game, but it's worth noting that he played really strong defense all game long. Draymond Green, who was still rounding into shape after missing three preseason games with a knee injury, had an up-and-down game as well. He was terrific defensively at certain stretches and rebounding the basketball. He also had some questionable decisions on offense and finished with just two points. Perhaps the biggest storyline for the Warriors entering the season was how the center rotation would shake out with DeMarcus Cousins sidelined. Damian Jones not only started the game, but received full-on starters minutes, something we haven't seen in recent years from Warriors centers. Jones played 27 minutes and acquitted himself very nicely with 12 points, 3 blocks, and a few monster jams. Kavon Looney also played a lot of minutes, both at center and at power forward, and other than Curry and Durant, was the Warriors' best player. Looney played excellent defense, both inside and on the perimeter, and displayed some strong offensive instincts as well. He finished with the team's only double-double, with 10 points and 10 rebounds. Bad news for the Warriors was Andre Iguodala, who left the game in the second quarter as he was feeling tightness in the same leg that kept him out of the playoffs. Iguodala was officially listed as questionable, but he didn't return to the game, so we'll have to keep an eye on that as he seems to be getting increasingly dinged up recently. The Warriors had an excellent first half. They took a 10-point lead to halftime. They were up 57-47. But we're used to seeing crazy third quarters from the Warriors, and that was nowhere to be found on Tuesday night. The Thunder outscored the Warriors in the third by six points and made it a very close game going into the final frame. But in the end, the Warriors just had too much talent for a Thunder team lacking Russell Westbrook, and they won the season opener 108-100. to 100.